this next mission of Atlantis to perform the uh, final servicing on the Hubble Space Telescope will be uh, flown by Commander Scott Altman, Pilot Greg Johnson, Mission Specialists Mike Good, Megan MacArthur, John Grunsfeld, Mike Massimino, and Drew Feustel. There are five spacewalks planned for this flight to deliver new hardware to upgrade the operations of the Hubble Space Telescope, as well as to uh, make repairs to some of the existing uh, the existing instruments and get them uh, back into uh, operating at their full capacity. Yesterday morning's rollover of Atlantis from the OPF to the VAB began at uh, 10.30 Central Time, 11.30 Eastern Time at the Kennedy Space Center. And Atlantis was spotted in the VAB transfer aisle at uh, 12.23 p.m. KSC time yesterday. So the process we're seeing here in about five minutes took, uh, in fact, about 53 minutes to accomplish yesterday. of the space shuttle from the orbiter processing facility to the vehicle assembly building is a, is a big milestone in preparation for flight. The uh, mating to the external tank and solid rocket booster stack, that process and uh, the mating and then the checkout usually takes about a week before the uh, orbiter and the ET and SRVs are then uh, transported on the mobile launch platform out to the launch pad. Same launch pad from which Discovery was launched a little more than a week ago. At this time, the movement of Atlantis from the VAB out to the launch pad expected for uh, March 31st. Atlantis uh, there in the VAB as of 12.23 uh, Eastern Time yesterday afternoon. We'll also note that uh, Endeavour, being prepared for its next mission to the International Space Station, will also serve as a uh, in-standby uh, on Shuttle Launch Pad 39B as a rescue vehicle for the crew of Atlantis, should that be necessary. But uh, once released from that duty, Endeavour would be relocated to pad 39A for its station resupply mission, STS-127, which is uh, targeted to launch in June.